team. I am a very spiritual person. I'm sure that came from pretty clear. I'm very spiritual. Uh, I recently went to a psychic healer. Well, I couldn't afford a real psychic healer. I had to go to the psychic school and get a student healing. Which is a lot like going to dental school to get your teeth fixed. I'm not going to pay thousands of dollars to a professional psychic to get this crack in my aura fixed. But I went to the I, I mean, recently became interested in power animals. I'm trying to connect with my power animal. Does anyone know what a power animal is? Because I'm going to tell you. you know, yeah. I, I found out about power animals in a bi monthly free New Age newspaper. And it had an article about power animals. And I read it. And it said a power animal is a spiritual embodiment of an animal that gives you help and guidance in life. That sounds awesome. So I decided to do some extensive research on power animals. I finished that article. And here's what I learned. There are many different kinds of animals can be your power animal. What animal is your power animal reflects the kind of help and guidance you get and what kind of person you are. For instance, your power animal can be a bear. That is an earth creature, a forest creature. So you are more connected to the forest and the creatures in it. And through that connection, you will find love and understanding for all things. Your power animal might be a dolphin. That is an ocean creature. That means you're more in touch with the water and the sea and the creatures in it. And through that connection, you will come down with love and understanding for all things. Let's say your power animal is a spider. You are probably an asshole. You can be many kinds of creature in power animal. Even mythical creatures like dragons or unicorns can be a power animal because it's all made up bullshit anyway. Pick something good. There are some things that cannot be power animals. For instance, domesticated pets are not power animal eligible. They are too far from the wild to help you. That's right, even further from the wild than made up shit like dragons and unicorns. Besides, what kind of jam is a parakeet going to get out, get you out of? You're not a coal miner. Also, power animals cannot be insects, except for dragonflies and butterflies, because apparently a lot of wicked ladies already had the tattoo. So they got grandfathered into the power animal category. Patrick, you're a power animal. Now with all this, you may be wondering, what is your power animal? What is your power animal? What is your power animal? If you think an animal is your power animal, it is. Oh, I was triple Leo. It's the main way you decide. Triple Leo. Now it's supposed to be a major laugh in this bed, but fuck you guys. August. Okay, well, I'm not like that. I wasn't sure what my power animal was. What is your power animal? That's why I went to the psychic healer. I asked her, what is my power animal? She said, I'm a liar. It's probably a spider. Yeah, I'm a liar. I'm a liar. <laughs> All right, I want to thank you guys. I hope you have a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. You guys have a great night. Thanks a lot. Save the universe, so strong. Thank you. He's available for weddings, parties, and circumcisions that apparently not his own circumcision. So. Uh, thank you for the 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 Thank you